Welcome back everyone to another The Flying Vlog. I've brought Sam with me today. He has. So, um, we did a flight on the 6th of January and we did exactly what we've got here, which is the VOR DME runway 21. Mucked up the hole. Badly. Yeah. You got the second one back, but the first one was a bit, um, how shall we say, wobbly. The second one was better. The second one was better. It was good. It we was, landed good. from that one rather than going around a third time. Yes. So we're planning on doing one hold. Correctly. Uh, correctly. Uh, compensating for the wind this time. Compensating for the wind. There is none. Which is they good. will be up there. Those clouds are moving. It's, I think it's about it's 10 knots at 260. So I roughly think it's 3 degrees coming this way and then 6 degrees in total coming up. Um, obviously, you're my safety pilot once again. I don't know how you brave yourself up for that. No idea. <laughs> But thanks for the 10 grand in my bank account. No problem. I think this time what we do is we request radar vectors to Alkin because it's not a weekend. They're highly likely to be busy and probably won't let us do it procedurally. So if I get them to vector us to Alkin, we'll start our... I'll hold at Alkin once we're at Alkin. Let's see what happens when we get in the air. I think if we request radar vectors to Alkin when we pick them up, uh, northeast of city. Radar vectors to Alkin when we get to Alkin. Um, obviously, we're flying inbound 240. We go right 060 to tunnel DME 10. Hopefully, I track it correctly. So, we're tracking off a radial of 048 and at 10 it should be centered. That will mean we've actually done the hold correctly. Correctly, correct. When we come back round, we'll get to DME 8.1. We start the procedure for, for the VOR DME runway 2. Yeah, well, what do you start? So we'll obviously set it to 060 first mm -hmm. and then we'll fly to the... Oh, what are you doing to get to the ILS? We'll fly to the left of the needle. What are you doing? It's called the arc. Good! That was the word yes. I was looking for. A DME arc. So we do the DME arc, uh, we'll set it and we try and keep it to DME 7. I think, what did I do last time? 7.9 got it down to 7. No, initially. you were 7. You were 7. You were seven. You were initially it wasn't. Yeah, well, once you're actually established on the yacht, <coughs> you're at seven. Yeah, all the way around. Yeah, all the way around. Didn't and walk, don't look out the window. Didn't walk, no, no, it's iron. Don't look out the window. Yeah. yeah, so obviously, all the way around, we're going to be flicking it around till we get to 203. So we're going to set up VOR1 to 203. Mm -hmm. VOR2 will be set to get us all the way around. Good. And then obviously, we'll come down. 20% uh, power. I think what worked last time, which was really, really good, is we set the um, approach power 50% when we was just before 8.1 and we put a stage of flat in because it was 108 knots. And then we come off this procedure, we did this at 108 knots. Otherwise, we'd be too fast trying to descend and also trying to fly the plane at the same time is probably hard work mm -hmm. for me at this stage anyway. So, what's your approach speed? So, my approach speed will be um, when we get to 4.5 miles, we will reduce to 20% power. And one stage of flat till I get the runway, which is 890. So, so, so far, you've told me power, you've told me percentage of power, yeah. and the stage of flat. So about you 95 knots. Thank you. So, that, looking down here, what have you got? 95 knots, so that'd be 500 feet a minute. Four, 450 feet a minute. Yeah, about that. So, if you do 450, set it so it's 450 feet per minute, don't yeah. worry about the blinking percentage of power, set it so it's 450 feet per minute, and it will sit there and it will go down nice and steadily yeah. down that approach. And all you then have to do is check left and right left because and right. it will do everything else for yep. you nicely. Yeah? Yep. Obviously, once we land, OK, to the right, we want to get off at Delta again. Look at the wrong procedure. Get off at Delta and then straight and park up. Coffee, refuel, back to begin. Sounds like, sounds like a plan? Sounds like a plan. So that was all good. Stand. Uh, we are fuel filled, we've got 140 litres, so we've got enough to go to Southern France. Cool. I'm sure you don't want to spend a whole ton of money. We've all been to Southern France without my husband, I think he'd be rather upset with me. Yep, I'm sure anyone would. Okay, so that's all good. Uh, we'll brief for the departure in the plane and let's get going. Cool. Okay, departure brief, so 2 1 left, left hand turn, noise abatement. 500 feet flaps up, um, continue climb to 2,000 feet, get rid of these outside the ATZ, Thames radar, traffic service with a radar, vectors to Alkin. Quick. Right. Right landing light taxi. What are they doing? I don't know, they sort of went past you and then just sat right, there. Stapled 03, lining up runway 21. Stapled 03, roger, wind 270 degrees at 5 knots. Golf November Yankee lining up 2 1 left behind. Golf November Yankee, Roger, wind 270 degrees and 4 knots. Approach clear, runway 
is occupied. Well, if you saw how close his propeller went to hitting the ground going into those potholes, he wouldn't have done the route he did. How long do you reckon we should give it? Not yet. Stable for radio, Golf Bravo, Mike Tango, Bravo, requesting radio check. Nice early D lighting system there. Golf Bravo, Tango, Mike Bravo, your readability five. Five, Golf Tango, Bravo, go for fuel. Time you go airborne. Another 15 seconds. Roger, 35, call it, yeah. Blowing that way anyway, slightly. Yeah. Okay, good to go. Go from November Yankee to Parsec 2 1 left. Full power, feet on the ground. Airspeed rising. Temperature's pressure's green. Birds on the runway. Airspeed rising, looking for 59 knots. Nine we have, rotates. Two for three three is at the hold rate for departure, landing up runway two on left. Sixty-six knots, just climb out. Hey, that's uh, Stapleford three two. three two, Roger. Hey, so approaching five hundred foot, left turn to avoid the farm. Visual with one ahead. Up. Bro, just coming out of the ATZ, so we'll get rid of them and go to Thames Radar. Golf November Yankees departing to the southeast or anything outside OCAS. Uh, we're going to contact uh, Thames Radar now, 1327 away. Watch out. Six miles away, Altitude 4,000 feet. Watch out, Altitude 4,000 feet. Jersey 4, wish you get a bit of a fire trigger, wish you contact City Sound 118 decimal 080. Tower 1800, Flyer 3, thanks for Thames Radar, good afternoon, Golf Sulu Alpha, November Yankee traffic service. Alpha, uh, November Yankee, you remaining outside control airspace? A firm heading uh, 140 to your northeast. Okay, make the request please with either special VFR on 125625 or travel radar 132 decimal 8. Okay, we're going into Biggin, Golf November Yankee. Okay, in which case, stand out of by, I will come back to you shortly. Look at all that wasted space that we're going to use for housing. Jersey 1 Remy Yankee, descent to altitude 4,000. Or commonly known as golf course. 4,000 feet, 1 Remy Yankee. Flyer 37 Delta, reduce speed 190. Speed 190, Flyer 37 Delta. Probably won't let us do the hold by the sounds of it. Let's see where he comes. Motion 658. 2,000 we have. 150 in the heading. We're remaining outside of controlled airspace. Uh, Rock, uh, we have a rat, uh, what's the point uh, before that? Another golf course. Oscar Kilo Victor Alpha Papa. Oscar Kilo Victor Alpha Papa, and then rat, uh, section 658 hotel. Flight 37 Delta, reduce speed 160, we're not maintain until 60 ME. Reducing 160 to 60 ME, flight 37 Delta. Oh, how, how many people use golf courses in the UK? 1.5 million. How much money does it bring into the UK economy? Two billion. How much? How many um, uh, active private pilots are there? Five, three, seven, Delta, descent to altitude, three thousand. Uh, Twenty-seven thousand, isn't it? Something like that. And how much money do we bring into the UK economy? Twenty billion. Three billion. Uh, and yet they want to build on airfields and not golf courses. We should start building on golf courses. It occupies two percent of the UK's land mass. <laughs> Uh, 37 Delta contact City Tower 118 Delta 080. 118 080 by fly 27 Delta. November Yankee score 7045. 7045 you have, go on November Yankee. 7045 kilos will be leveled on to 3000 feet on the X-Nerve 1 Alpha departure. 545 kilos, Tamsuida score cadet report 7 miles north east of City. I don't call you 7 miles, 55 kilos. Fashion 658 Hotel, descent flight level 7 direct. Descent 7 0, Fashion 658 Hotel. What was that you were saying about it being BMC? 
Here's VMC. Yankee, speed 190 knots. Speed 190 knots, Jersey 1 Radio Yankee. Touch the 658 Hotel, descent to altitude 6,000 feet, the city QNH 1019, runway 27 in use. 6,000, uh, we are 1,950 feet on QNH 1019. We request a radar vector to Alkin for the VOR DME procedure. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Okay, so just quickly check at uh, seven miles Alkin, we need to turn left, right of heading 060 until we get to tunnel. Uh, I, from what I worked out, it was about 054, six degrees of drift. Cool. So this is 240, so I'm intercepting the radial. I'm within the mileage, so it's good. So what did he ask you to do? Report in the hold. Right, so why didn't you tell Max that? I need to descend to 1800 as well. Yeah. So why didn't you just report back to him? God knows how many you report in the hold. That's all you have to say. Yeah, rather than blocking up the frequency. Blah, 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 Okay, so on COM2, I need to set this to 048. Cool. Happy with that? Come on, Leaving altitude. Oh, for that's trying to kill me. You're still doing that thing where you focus on the instrument? Yeah, I know. You must stop doing that. I know. It'll kill you. It'll kill you. Okay, so I'm looking for 7.1 miles, which we have now. Yeah. Golf November Yankees over at Alkin, 1,800 feet, entering the hold. November Yankee, Roger, report ready to commence the procedure. We'll go, Golf November Yankee. Uh, report ready, you right? We'll report ready for commence the procedure. Yeah. Repeat back what they want you to do. Okay, so just to double check. Way around to 055. That should then capture 048 on this. At 10 miles we turn right, and then at 8.1 we're commencing the procedure. So when do we start making that right turn, I'm going to put the flaps in. It's 108 knots, and I'm going to let him know that we're commencing the procedure. Okay. And uh, if I'm correct, this one needs to be set up to runway heading once we commence the procedure. And we're using this one to set up the heading. Will be... Yankee traffic information, please EC135 in your 12 o'clock. Range of four and a half miles, 1,100 feet, trucking northwest. Uh, looking off of Ember Yankee. Okay, so that's including wind correction. So this is plan one, two, and three. 1,800 feet, I'm tracking 055. Five. Attendee and me, I'm going to put the flaps down once I reduce the speed to 108 knots. And I'm going to call him commencing the procedure. I'm going to set this to a heading of 060, and then when I get to the EME, 8.1. traffic in your 12 o'clock range of around 6 miles, indicating 1,200 feet, tracking to south east. November Yankee, thank you. Fraction 658 Hotel, descent to altitude 3,000 feet, cleared ILS, runway 27. 3,000 feet, cleared ILS. So when I get out to 04 I'm setting out to 060, aren't I? What's that telling you now? Flight. What was over here? What do you think you have? I need some more, more flights to the left. Fraction 658 Hotel, there is no further speed control, report established. You can actually calculate, is it up for uh, two degrees each one, isn't it? Is that right? For this distance. Yes, at that, that distance, yes, now. Okay, so 10.1 miles, turn right. But that's got to be in the middle, and it's not. I think we'd better just commence the procedure, he's busy, isn't he? The hold's not the greatest, but we can still practice it elsewhere. I think you need to go back and practice that under a simulator, I have you? Yeah. Altitude. Yep, go back to 1800. Right, let's reduce the power, 50%, get a stage of flapping. I take it commencing the procedure is when we get to uh, Alkin, isn't it? Yes. Uh, 8.1 miles, sorry. No. Zero the heading set, and the runway heading is... Zero What are you saying this one? Zero six zero initially. Oh. And then we follow it around, don't we? We set it, fly to the left, basically. Yeah, so you fly that heading. That's when we get to DME. 
1800 feet, altitude 240 degrees to Alkin. Do we have a listen to the ATIS or you reckon? Uh, we know what it is. And if you like. 019 Peto back gold. Okay, 8.1 miles. So oh, heading 330. So what, what's the information you need to tell them? Have to listen again. Golf uh, November Yankees commencing the procedure. November Yankees, Red Two Port established on the 7 DME arc. Uh, we'll go Golf November Yankee. Where's the wind from? From that way. So it's going to push us that way, away from it, so we need to correct to the left. They call it 320. Oh, we're going to have 5 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 3 Coming down nicely now, isn't it? No. James Gray, Frank Schwartz, Hotel Lima, Papa Mike, Falcon 2000. We are descending flight level 100 to Airgex. Altitude. Rockford Hotel Lima, Papa Mike, Thames Director, thank you. You're cleared for the last note. One, runway 27. Maintain 250 knots or greater. Maintain 250 knots or greater. Clearly, land no one got arrival from runway 27. Frank Schwartz, Papa Mike. Golf November, Yankee report established on the inbound radio. Uh, we're 70 meters now, and the report established on the inbound radio. Golf November, Yankee. Foxtrot to Papa. Is this echo? Yes, we have uh, echo, Foxtrot to Papa Mike. Coming in now. 203. About 50%. Fire T3 X-ray, contact London, 118 decimal 825. Goodbye. 825, Fire T3 X-ray, bye now. 100 feet until we get to four and a half miles. Don't come in too quickly. Yeah, I'm outside of the white arc. Go down to 20% at four and a half miles. Gold to the Alpha November Yankee is established on the inbound radio. It's for the VOR DME procedure on my T1. Cleared for the VOR One Gold November Yankee. November Yankees, my radar service terminates. Contact begin approach 129.405. There's no contact seen to effect. Bye bye. That's all copied. Contact uh, 4 November Yankee. Bye bye. Begin uh, approach. Uh, good off. Yankee 5 and a half. 2 1. Go to Alpha November Yankee, begin approach. Continue approach on my 2 1. QNH 1019. Continue in 1019. Go for November Yankee. Altitude and you're descending, stop it. They're waiting for four and a half miles, it's approaching, and they're reduced to 20% power. I haven't got the altitude set, it's all over the bloody place. 18. That's the white arc, right. four and a half miles. So descend down, go down, get that down to 450 feet, stabilise it at that, and it'll do everything you need it to do. Nice light to the left. Clear to land, 2-1, Golf November Yankee. Leaving altitude. So, 3.2 miles, just above. 2 miles, 1,040 feet. Stop chasing it. Let it settle down. So two miles, 1,040 feet.
Vision I 890. Two miles should be 1,000. What's your decision? 890 feet. So, two miles, 1,040 feet. Third the white arc, 90 knots. In for 890 feet. Going up and down like a horse draws. 890 feet. Four stage plan. That wasn't as good as the last one, was it? No. Because obviously I haven't flown in two months. I'll do it. So 80 knots, so I want to get down to 75. Guess while I wasn't flying, I should have been using that sim I've got. Okay, landing gear's down, fix, prop, brakes off, temperature, pressure, screen, fuel. Thanks for that. On the point, the runway zero three.